The heat is on across the country with excessive heat warnings in place. And here in San Diego, we are in the midst of July Fry. And that's why it's essential to recognize the signs of dehydration. Joining us with Hydration Solutions for Beating the Heat is author and nutritionist Pam Misevich Bede. She's teaming up with Pedialyte and global healthcare company Abbott to share timely tips and tools for proper hydration. Pam is a leading sports nutrition expert and author of Fuel the Fire, a nutrition and body confidence guidebook for female athletes. Welcome, Pam. Hi, thank you for having me. Now, can you talk to us about how to spot the first signs of dehydration and explain why hydration is so important? Certainly. So as a sports dietitian, mom to three active kids, and as an active and sweaty runner myself, I can tell you that staying on top of your hydration is really, really important for health and performance. And here's why. 60 to 70% of our bodies are made up of water. Losing just 2% of that body weight due to dehydration can result in feelings of lethargy, feeling a little irritable, a little flushed, dizzy, even have a headache related to dehydration. And sometimes thirst is not always the best indicator of whether or not we need to add in fluids. So hydration is something that we want to be proactive about across the day, especially during those days when we know we're going to be outside in the sun, in the hot and humid temperatures. And speaking of being outside, working, playing sports, or having fun in the sun, can you break down some easy ways to beat the heat? Certainly. So think through the before, the during, and the after of your day. So before you head out for some fun in the sun, you want to be preloading those fluids. So not only the water, but the scientifically backed Pedialyte that has the right blend of the fluids, the right blend of electrolytes that you need to replenish what you're losing in sweat. So electrolytes are these special nutrients, the sodium, the potassium, the chloride, that basically helps your body maintain the fluid balance, helps those muscles function optimally, and we can't always get those from foods and water alone, we want to go with a Pedialyte, a scientifically backed beverage. During our activity, we want to be sipping on fluids and afterwards, we want to replenish what we've lost. So adding in the fluids back, adding the electrolytes back, that we tend to lose across our day, especially during sweating times. Uh, we can cool down with a Pedialyte freezer pop, which is kind of a refreshing option, way to get electrolytes back into our system. So we just want to be proactive across our day. Those Pedialyte freezer pops look like such a refreshing treat. <laughs> they are. Yeah. Now, what are some tools and strategies to hydrate? So other ways to hydrate, think through what you're eating across your day because you can get up to 20% of your fluid needs from foods alone. So a lot of the fruits, the vegetables, cucumbers, melon, a lot of these items are up to 90% just water. Plus you're getting in the vitamins, the minerals, fiber that most of us don't get enough of, as well as electrolytes. So you're working on hydration, but you're also nourishing your body. So you can do both things at once when you choose more fruits and vegetables. And what else can adults and kids do this summer to stay hydrated? It's a good point. Both kids and adults really need to think through hydration. So if you've got kids at home, you're probably going to need them, need to remind them to hydrate, sip on fluids throughout the day, pause on the sugary beverages. So high sugar beverages may be a source of energy, but they actually slow down hydration. So before we grab the juices, the pops, and other beverages, we want to pause and just grab the Pedialyte, the waters instead, because those are our sources for the rehydration, not the sugary beverages. When you're feeling hot or you're feeling not so hot, you may it may be time to rehydrate. You may be starting to feel a little bit dehydrated, and that's when you grab that scientifically backed electrolyte electrolyte solution like a Pedialyte so that we can replace and rehydrate and feel better fast. And where can we go for more information? You can visit Pedialyte.com. You can find Pedialyte in the baby and pharmacy aisle or on Amazon.com. Pam, we thank you so much for these important and timely tips to stay healthy this summer. Thank you, Laura. And we thank you for joining us on San Diego Living. We'll see you next time.